Hey everyone, let's look at balancing the equation for the combustion of propane. On the left side, the reactants, we have this big molecule, propane, and O2, oxygen. And after the reaction, the, re the products uh, will be CO2, right here, and H2O, water. To balance this equation, first we are going to count up the atoms we have on each side that are within these molecules. On the left side, the reactants, let's count up the carbon and we can see we have three here and we also can see we have a three next to the one molecule up here. So that leaves us with three carbon. Below that, hydrogen, you could count them up here or look at the number here for eight and O2, just the two oxygen atoms in this molecule of O2. Moving over to the right side, the carbon count looks like it is just one. And when we have nothing here, we can assume it is a, a one. How about hydrogen? Well, there are two hydrogens in this molecule of water. And overall, the oxygens um, are in both molecules, so we have two here for in the carbon dioxide and one in the water. So first, let's try to balance the carbon, which seems pretty easy. We have three on this side. We need to find three on this side. Let's start by multiplying this carbon dioxide by three. And by our recount now, we have three carbons and oxygen changed. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven now down to the hydrogen. How can we make this two hydrogen on this side equal to the eight over here? Well, let's multiply this by four. One, two, three, and four, which is going to balance our hydrogen. But it's also, again, going to throw off our oxygen count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, now our carbon balanced, hydrogen balanced. Let's finish this off by balancing the oxygen. Um, over here we have two, and we need to balance that and get it up to 10. So let's take and make five of these over here. Multiply that out, and now we are left with 10. So looking at the whole equation, might need to make this smaller, um, we still only have one propane molecule. But now we have five, we can count them here, five oxygen molecules, three carbon dioxide, and four water. And now we have a balanced equation for the combustion of propane. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Bye.